totally the life, bruh. Out in nature, everything all peaceful and stuff. You said it, Brosif. This truly is where real guys like us belong. <laughs> oh, lunch tarts are done, dude. Killer, and the game's back on. Whoa! Yeah, Whoa, whoever owns the lake forgot to pay the electric bill. Dude, do you hear that? Our, our TV, it's moving, get it! Must be those jokers from Omega House. Whoa. Our stuff! Oh no, my microwave! My juicer! My curling iron! Your what? Uh, no time to explain. Let's get out of here! Thermal sleeping bags. The archer men are ready to fish. Excited, Ty? Fishing? Sorry, not a fan. Ty, we're playing a fishing video game right now. Yeah, but real fishing is real boring. There's no water bombs, frog people, or uh, piranha attack clusters. Got them. Uh, I'll go, Dad. Whoa. I love fishing. The technique, the tension, oh, the fish got. Sorry, Abby. It's kind of a father-son thing. Maybe next time, okay? Come on, Ty, those fish won't catch themselves. Oh, no fair. Watch that front step. <laughs> ah, beautiful. Reminds me of my first fishing trip with your grandpa. Ty? You know, Ty, it's not every day you get to enjoy nature like this. Well, it's not every day I get to planet tour on with eight extra lives and full body armor either. Okay, that's it. <laughs> New rule for the trip. Absolutely, positively, no gadgets. Put it in here. But, but, Dad. No. Oh. What else? Load it up. Hi, this weekend we will be men living off the land. No cell phones, no TVs, nothing that makes our lives fun. Complicated. Don't worry, one day you'll thank me for this. Yeah, well, tell that to the peaceful people of planet Turon, now that the Doomsday Destroyers are gonna eat them for breakfast. Knock, knock. Honey, I know you're bumming about missing out on the fishing trip, but I've got the perfect cure. A mother-daughter fun day. Thanks, Mom. But I wouldn't call gardening fun. What? Gardening? Uh, don't be silly. I, I was actually thinking you and I could go, uh, well? Hmm. Rock climbing? Really? That's awesome! I know just the spot, Mount Forbodi. We're talking big wall granite with class five vertical. Thanks, Mom. Oh dear. Hmm, this seems like a good spot for bait. Oh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Dang messy city slickers. All you care about is catching big chummo. Heh, <laughs> good luck. You've got us all wrong, old timer. We archers are simple fishermen. All we need is a rod, a reel, and a whole bunch of worms. We'll catch Big Chummo the old-fashioned way, right, Ty? Mm -hmm. Now, what the heck is a Big Chummo? I think it might be that. Whoa, that is one big fish. Big Trigimungus. Big Chummo's the hugest, meanest, orneriest fish in three counties. The name's Gundy McGoober, and this here's my store. 
Nice to meet you, Gundy. I seen your type before, coming up here and messing up my lake with all your garbage. Worms is three dollars. And don't you try giving me no big city credit cards. Cool. Oligokita annelids. Them's earthworms, kid. Right, but I was just using the scientific classification. And if y'all think you're gonna reel in Big Chummo, think again. That there fish is uncatchable. It's been 40 years since the last poor fool managed to hook him. That hippie battled Big Chummo for days. But in the end, it was the fish a chuckling. Mm. Well, if you ask me, that story sounds a little fishy. You see, sturgeon are bottom feeders. They use their snouts to stir up the lake bed to find crustaceans and small fish to eat. They don't even have teeth. Big chummo, more like big gummo. <laughs> Time for the archer men to get their fish on. We're coming for ya, big chummo. <laughs> Good luck, city fellers. You're gonna need it. Oh, honey, isn't this fun? Oh, I know. It's a blast. And who'd have thought I'd be such a natural climber? What with my paralyzing fear of heights? Your what? Oh, yes. Heights have always made me queasy. Like if I go up in a skyscraper, or even just one of those tall SUVs. The key is just not to look. <laughs> Down. Uh, Mom, you okay? <laughs> Hold on, Mom. They'll uh, have you down in no time. <laughs> <laughs> ah, the old fishing hole. Well, time to get down to business. Oh, yuck. Oh. Ah, piece of cake. Now make sure the lid on the bait cooler is tight. Any heat will dry those worms out. I think it's high time I shared the secret archer family fishing technique. Oh boy. The wandering worm. Uh, great. <laughs> wandering worm, step one. Know your surroundings. Consider the topography, the climate zone, and of course, the barometric pressure. Step eight. Keep the reel high above your head. The extra leverage will help to wear out the fish. Step 21, don't forget to talk to your bait. Encourage it. Let it know not to be afraid. And once you release the fish back into the water, it's time for step 32, beginning the process all over again. Got it, Ty? <laughs> Ty? Huh? Oh, I, um, got it. Ugh. Catch and release, and so forth. <laughs> Looks like Big Chummo was a little too much fish for them. But why were they all covered in dirt? Shh. Remember step 16. Stay quiet. Dad, did you hear that? Yeah. But there are lots of strange sounds out here in the wilderness. Nothing to worry about. Ah! Ah! <laughs> 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 oh, it's just an earthworm. Did you know there are 2,700 different types of earthworms, most with five pairs of hearts? Pretty cool, huh? Oh, that's nice, son. Now, we'll put him in the cooler with the others. That's strange. The top's open. And it's empty. You forgot to close the lid. Are you trying to sabotage our fishing by letting the worms loose? No way. The worms are the only part of this I like. Oh, you can just go back to the campsite and dig up some more. Oh. Now, Mom, you're sure you're up for this? Of course! Mountain biking is a perfect combination of excitement for you and staying on the ground for me. Whoa. Hi, I'm Greg, official park trail guide at your service. Mm. Oh, hi. I'm, uh, uh, um, Abby. 
Right. <laughs> Abby. <laughs> uh, and uh, this is my mom. Are you guys new to the trails? I'd be happy to give you the tour, I mean, if you don't mind the company. <laughs> Thanks, Greg. That would be lovely. Hold on tight. It gets a little bumpy. On our way. <laughs> Did he say bumpy? Weird. Everyone's gone. All right. Where are you, little critters? Hmm. Gotcha! Well, that's one down and... Hello? Uh, someone there? Huh? What the... Um, I was just borrowing him. Oh. Ah! <laughs> hey, you! Help! Oh. Help! Sorry, Ty. You'll have to find those worms on your own. I've got a bite! You're mine now, big chummo! Oh. Yeah! Oh. Get off! Hey! Stay out of our tent! Um, that was different. Dad! Worms! They're taking our stuff! What? Ty, that's ridiculous! Now watch! Here comes the patented over-the-shoulder archer twist! Oh! I... I... I got him! Oh huh? No. Oh. Dad, seriously, we need to get out of here fast. This isn't over yet, Big Chummo! I know you're in there. I can sense your presence. You magnificent beast. You are near, aren't you? You are this way! <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Flatbread. Hey, Ty. Anything biting? Yeah, the worms. Huh? I was trying to dig up a worm when all of a sudden I heard this weird grunting noise. Next thing I knew, I was surrounded. Did you say grunting? Hmm. <laughs> I think I may know what's up. Here it is. Worm grunting. It's a way of summoning up worms. Worm grunters put wooden stakes in the ground and rub them against a piece of metal. Nobody knows why, but the vibration makes worms pop up like crazy. Stirring up worms, I get. But how could someone actually control them? One second, Dad. Lab rat, any idea how someone could... <clears throat> Uh-oh. <laughs> Listen, there's this ride a bunch of us are going on tomorrow. Yeah. And, uh, I was thinking that if you weren't too busy... <laughs> yeah? You might like to come with the... <laughs> Sorry, kids. That bumpy ride really shook up my tummy. Uh, I gotta go. <laughs> Keep the helmet! But, but... Oh... <laughs> <laughs> Dad, what, it, what? It's not what it looks like. So this is what you've been up to all this time. Dad, I can explain. You're watching music videos on this newfangled pod thingy? I am? I, I mean, I am, yeah. You got me. <laughs> this isn't even entertaining. Where's the dancing? Sorry, Dad. I'll put it away. Nope. This calls for drastic action. Dad! <laughs> You'll thank me for this one day. Now back to camp with you and try to find some worms this time. 
No gross gear, no partner, no lab rat, and weirdo worms. Could this trip get any worse? Uh -oh. ah! Ah! Yikes. Help! Uh, hey guys. You must be giant blue earthworms. I can tell by the pink around your heads. And the... Your flowery scent. Ah! And by your ability to spit. Biking, um, incident. That's okay. I'm just glad Mother Daughter Fun Day is finally over. Over? Who said it was over? I still have one more activity in mind. And as you kids say, it's totally the bomb. Mom, hasn't today been enough of a bomb already? Abby Archer, those sound like the words of a quitter. And I did not raise a quitter. But, Mom. Now get your coat. Let's go have some fun. Whoa, it's like the electronics department at Mega Mart in here. Dad! Eh, not so fast, youngin. He's mine. I mean, ours. <laughs> you, you're behind all this? That's right. Old Gundy McGoober and his slippery friends are taking back the lake. By stealing all this stuff by kidnapping my dad? <laughs> Ever since that crazy-haired hippie, Hook Big Chummo in 68. You city-fied folk have ruined my lake with your loud electronics and littering. Guys like your dad will do anything to catch Big Chummo, no matter how much of a mess they make. But dad's all about preserving the land. You know, catch and release fishing, take only pictures, leave only footprints, all that junk. <laughs> yeah? Then how'd this here gizmo get into the lake? Okay, fair enough. But what about your bait shop? Without guys like my dad, you'd be out of business. I only sells the worms so they can chase people away. Besides, who needs a business when you got... Worms! Ah! I'm gonna make sure none of you city slickers ever come back. <laughs> oh, Abby, isn't this place sick? I'm feeling sick, all right. Now, where is that cool new game? You know, the one with the yellow guy who eats the ghosts? Uh, well, if it isn't Abby Archer, out with the world's oldest gamer. Hello, Paige. Look, everybody! Abby's grandma's playing her first video game ever! <laughs> Abby, help! The video men are shooting at me! Lady? <laughs> Oh, man, where'd she go now? Oh, no. <laughs> Mom, please, can't we just go home, haven't we? <laughs> hey, you're pretty good at this.
city boy! <laughs> Worm, don't fail me now. Time for the over-the-shoulder archer twist. Back off, Gundy, or the worm gets it. Wow! Wow! Looks like the worm has turned. Yeah, you city slickers got lucky. They don't ever let me catch you in these here parts again. Next time, you won't be able to squirm away. <laughs> Ty, you caught Big Chummo. Well, I'll be. See, Dad? Catch and release, just like you taught me. Amazing. Son, this is one for the history books. Wait. We didn't get a picture. Ty, where's my digital camera? Aww. Uh, now no one will believe we caught Big Chummo. It's okay, Dad. We'll bring one next year.